Hi, and welcome back to another super awesome artistic episode with me, Brush Tips with Sherry. Today, we have a special guest who came all the way from Akron. <laughs> Akron, I will let you introduce yourself. Folks, I'm Hank from 3 Throw to Go, and uh, we're excited to be here. I'm a little bit nervous, but we'll see how it goes. <laughs> what are you nervous about? Because I just don't do this, and, and I just I don't want it to look like silly. That's all. That's my goal. All right. All right. Even if you look silly, my audience loves it. Okay. All right. So this is Hank from 330 to Go. What we are going to be doing today is this super basic, super easy painting here. Um, this is the seam of a soft baseball. We'll go baseball because you're a guy. Do you play softball or baseball? Both. Okay. So we're going to go with uh, baseball. So he, he needed something easy. Okay. He was a little nervous. So today our paint colors are pretty basic. They're pretty easy. Red, orange, yellow, green, blue, purple, black, white. This is your paint palette. Okay. Are you excited? Is there any way I hold it? Just like If you this get paint or? on the floor, they fire you. So okay. <laughs> be careful. All right. <laughs> Just kidding. They don't fire you. Here's your brush. Okay. Big daddy brush. Okay. Okay. Got it. See how big that guy is? Yep. Are you nervous? No. I'm, All right. I'm put it in better. this cup of water right here. You put it in first? Yeah, put it in there. Okay. My paint palette's a little messy because I've already been painting. Now what do I do with the water? See this paper towel right there? You're going to touch the paper towel. Gotcha. So we're going to start off with this big brush. Ready? Okay. Yep. So all I want you to do is paint your background white. Right now? Right now. Pa you want to see me do it first? Just paint it white. Yeah, just like this. All right. And you don't have an apron on, so don't get uh, paint on your clothes. I, gotta, I forgot an apron for you. I got to be careful. Got you. Yep. It doesn't have to be perfect because we're just going to start adding a bunch of colors here in a minute. So just throw a whole bunch of white paint on. I'm just giving you a base right now. Okay. So because this background is mostly white, we want to add this good thick base on there so that it dilutes some of our colors. Okay. And it's okay that it's going to be wet? Yeah, we want it to be wet for okay. this painting, yes. Yeah, it, it just makes the brush slide a little bit easier when we're mixing the other colors because they're kind of getting mixed into it and kind of not. You'll see as we start to go. All right. I'm listening. So. I'm just behind. So you're based out of Akron, right? Yes, we are. But and we, co we cover all the 3 3 all right? And you have a large social media get together thing going, right? Yep. Okay, my painting's done. How about you? I'm there. You're all done? Kind of. Doesn't have to be perfect, right? Yeah, no, look. Look at mine. <laughs> <laughs> Stop! <laughs> oh, I'm not, I'm, not, I'm not supposed to yell. My bad. Okay. <laughs> no yelling. All right, no yelling. No yelling. We, we're, three throw to go is very loud. We're, we're very loud. This is, That's okay. This is a different environment. Th yeah, this is zen. Okay, we're zen. This is zen. Okay, now what? Okay, you got all yours painted? I think. What's your favorite color? My favorite color is typically blue. All right, so let's grab a little bit of that blue. With the brush still white. Yeah. Okay. And just throw it on there where you want it. This, just this one's blue right here? That's yeah, purple? Yeah, that's purple. Purple and blue, yep. Okay. Like that? Yep. Wherever you want it. There you go. All right, let's grab a little purple. Uh, it, with the color still there? Yeah. Yeah, it'll just add, you see how it just added that little shimmer of blue in there? Then you can rinse off your brush. So when you rinse off your brush, it's like washing hair. You want to rub the bristles at the bottom of the cup. Okay. Okay, and then touch your paper towel again. Wait, wait, washing hair, you're acting like I've had hair. Didn't I, you just I, get a haircut? I cut the mullet off. <laughs> it was so weird, by the way, having hair. I just don't do that. All yeah, right. were you using like head and shoulders, doing like head and I shoulders commercials and stuff? I actually used conditioner. Like I used conditioner. Like 
for like a month and a half. It was so you weird. You could probably still use conditioner. It would only make your hair soft. Okay. All right. <laughs> I don't want you to feel like you had to part from it. Okay. All right. How about we grab some yellow? Now, when you grab it on your paintbrush, go ahead and scrape it off the side because really, this is how much we really need on our brush. You don't need a lot. Okay. All right. It kind of looks like mustard, yep. huh? And then just throw that on wherever. Wherever you want. And remember, when it mixes with other colors, it makes new colors. Okay. Okay. Then we can grab our orange. See, it freaks me out that we don't... That it's we, okay. Uh, that, it, Be that, careful going by the blue. What happens when blue and orange mix? Brown. Right. We call that mud. <laughs> <laughs> You are correct. Um, okay, so 330 to go is a network on social media where you guys have tons of followers, right? Yes. Um, and you report. We do a lot of stuff. So it's not just news. It, we do a lot of entertainment stuff too. Okay. And it's like, you know, we focus on, when we say the 330, it's the entire area code. So we really focus on Akron and Canton. I mean, my phone number is 440, just right, so right. we know. That's, and that's fine. Because I'm fine. from north. Right, right, right. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Right. But, yeah, so I'm we kidding. just do a lot of stuff. <laughs> my business phone number is 330. Okay. I got a tattoo that says 216. Okay. Are I'm we, just kidding. Are I we don't. going on a tangent right now? Is that what this <laughs> no, is? I'm just teasing you about your 330 number. <laughs> Um, because I love it. Because I love like when people represent using their area code. Right. It's fun. Right. It really is. I do. I do love the the three three zero to go. And every time I mention it, people all the time are like, "I know them. I watch them." So. Well, and we have grown, and and we, our team is very diverse. So I mean, we yeah. cover like I said, we cover a lot of stuff, and and there's more shows within it than just three three zero to go. Yeah, so. which makes it fun. Yes. Because then you have something for everyone. Exactly. Like WCTV, they have something for everyone, too. Uh, correct. Which is super fun. I'm freaking out right now because we should be Why? fading because I'm worried that I'm not going to get it done in time. We have 19 minutes. <laughs> okay. All right. <laughs> so you, we'll, I'll just stand here and wait. <laughs> You're like, oh, my, look how nervous you are. I am. All right, hang your arms down a little okay. bit. All right. Okay. Better? Yeah. Don't okay. make me make you take your shoes off. Okay. Because right. if we do that, then you then you're really relaxed. I I relaxing is not something that's in my nature. I don't relax either. <laughs> okay, so grab some white. Is your brush all clean? Oh, was go this? ahead and clean off your brush. When did you do that? <laughs> you didn't. You, you just I cleaned stuck, it off. You just snuck that in there while while <laughs> we were talking. I didn't see you do that. Get it real clean. Oh boy, it's got a lot of yellow in it. Yeah, I see that. Okay, that's good enough. We're just gonna add white. Oh, look, mine still has a little pink, little red in it. And then we're just going to go back over it with the white. So what if grab... I used all my white up already? You did? Why, I used a lot of it. Oh, yeah, I see that. It's all right. We got more. Okay. We have endless supplies. This whole thing is full. You're supposed to say when. Oh, yeah, good, good, good. Oh, good. okay. Okay. <laughs> You're like, stop messing with You're me. Just messing with me right now. <laughs> I do. All right, so what? Go down the middle. Because when people get super nervous, I'm like, why are you nervous? It's super fun. Yeah, just go right over everything. Over. Yeah, almost like you're erasing it. You're kidding me. No. We're just softening it up. Yours is pretty dark. Oh boy. What'd you do? I, I uh. Did I use too much white up top? Let's see. Right there? No, look at mine. That's what we want. That's what we want. Yep. You're doing fantastic. Really, you are. Okay. It's a fun, easy painting. There's really no way to go wrong on this. Okay. So, so um, what kinds of things are you covering right now? Well, I mean... There's a lot of things that, it, the interesting part about the news is that it's just that, it's news, right? So when we are doing a news story, it's whatever's happening that day. And, and every day is different. You never know what's going to happen, right? I mean, um, this week alone has just been crazy already, and it's only Wednesday. Um, 
you know, we had the big, the big brouhaha out at, uh, in McDonald's at, uh, in Ravenna. And then you had the, the Walmart, uh, Brimfield Walmart incident over the, uh, you know, on Sunday, that was Sunday, right? Yeah. Then you had, uh, you know, they closed the Route 91 and, and over in Ella, they closed Route 91 and Market to put in a new roundabout there. And right away they had a semi that couldn't manage the turn and knocked over a telephone pole and blew their tires out. So, I mean, this oh, is goodness. just, and this is just in three days, right? But that's the thing. There's always something happening. And, and when we do report on stuff, it's, it's very succinct, very brief to the point. Like yesterday, right. there was a SWAT team right down here. The, a, a gentleman had holed themselves up and was threatening to do harm to himself. And the SWAT team had to shut down the whole area, right? So we put a blip out that says, Where hey, am I doing yeah. this stuff? <laughs> <laughs> but that's the whole point. There's so much that people, we only report on probably 10% of what we get into our inbox because oh you know we we only we've changed the way that we do it as far as it's it's is it a danger to the public right now and is it causing any kind of a traffic disruption if we reported on every shooting and everything that was going on with AFD and APD it would be an all day every day thing all day long I don't watch the news at all right so that's why we we're very deliberate in terms of how we've changed our reporting style because of that so but yeah, I watch fun, nothing. Fun stuff wise, we, we renamed Route 8. We call it the Ocho now. And we've got shirts. <laughs> we're selling shirts. <laughs> and and um, that's from Dodgeball, the movie Dodgeball. Right. ESPN 8, you know. So, um, and then we've also started uh, the Voices in the Three Throw competitions coming up, the part two. Remember, we did it last yeah, year. It was yeah, great. Yeah. But it was the last big live event that we did right before the pandemic hit. So we're going to be doing right. that again this year. I do remember that one. That one was fun. Yeah. Um, if I knew how to sing, I'd join. Right. But I don't. It's okay. All right. So now we have to let this dry a second. Okay. Drop your brush in your cup. Okay. I'm going to teach you how to do the drying method. Okay. If you're at home, you can just grab a blow dryer. And since you had long hair, I'm sure you have one of those too now, right? <laughs> no, it's because of the girls. I got lots of girls. <laughs> Go ahead and just start fanning. And you didn't even hit your sides, did you? Uh, no, it's okay. It's all right. We're going to say, we're going to say, I <laughs> you, know about the sides. You could just be the artist who doesn't paint their sides. <laughs> I know about the sides. So, I, I, I've watched you enough to know okay, that you got to paint your this sides. This couple minute break is a good time for people to tune into 330 to go to check the news. Okay. And again, not only are we a news organization, but we're an entertainment organization. Or they can go let their dog out. Yeah. Or get a cup of coffee. Okay. Or whatever. And just let it dry. How do you know how do you know when it's dry? It won't be shiny. See how mine's shiny? Yeah. Yours is shiny, right? Yep. Yep. Yours is thick. You got a lot of paint on there. That's okay. It's all right. We have a minute. All right, I'm gonna look and see if anybody's even watching this thing. Oh my goodness. Let's see. Are there any comments? He's live on his. Uh, yeah, people on are watching. his phone there. So yeah. he just went ahead and interrupted our <laughs> broadcast here. Well, I'm, that's the whole point. You never know what's going to happen with you us. Never know. <laughs> you never know. Yesterday I was recording a show and the tutor called me, and I was literally texting on my watch, telling everyone to go get Nico on tutoring. Nice. I know, and it just worked, right? Kids, <coughs> kids do that. Well, he's only seven, so I had to get the the older one to get him on. Oh, it's remote learning. Yeah, she's in Minnesota. Ah, she's a reading specialist. Gotcha. That we hired to help him learn how to read. How's yours looking? It's pretty dry. I mean, it's thick, but there's. I'm gonna touch it. It's yeah, I see your little dot now. Now you have a little fingerprint <laughs> it's in there. It's a little there. wet. <laughs> it's I'll all paint right. over that fingerprint for sure. It's all right. All right. I think I'm ready to go. All right. Okay. So what we can do now, because you see how this one has some a little bit thicker spots on there. Uh-huh. We can add those thicker spots, okay? Okay. So now that we've kind of diluted all of this, rinse off your brush really good. Here, let me do it for you. So we get all that paint off. 
You got you got a lot of paint on your brush. Yeah. <laughs> well, that brush is a little sticky, huh? Must have taken the sticker off. Okay. So we don't have green on here. Is you it, have green? Is that green? You have green. I don't have green. Okay. Oh my goodness. I like the green. Okay. It makes like a minty color. So go ahead and scoop up a little bit of that green and just throw a couple little. We're just bringing that back out. Okay, wherever you want. Wherever you want to put it. It's pretty neat how you completely miss the whole middle of the canvas. You just have like a white streak going up. Because <laughs> in my brain, I'm thinking, okay, well, that's where the baseball seam's going to go. So I don't yeah, want go to put anything there. You we, know? Can, we can add white back over it. Let's clean that brush off. Touch your paper towel again. And you said blue's your favorite color, right? Sure. Okay, so let's hit this with some blue. And you can even grab a little red and throw a little red on there too since baseballs are typically have the red. And if you mix it with the blue, then you get this pretty color purple. See it down here? That's my favorite is mixing the blue with the red. Perfect. Are you going to hang this up? Mm-hmm. Okay, good. Perfect. I like it. Now we got to let this one dry real quick. So, now normally we sing while we let it dry. I don't believe you. Not on that one. Yes, I do. I sing, let it dry. <laughs> okay. Let it dry. <laughs> <clears throat> Go ahead. What? Go ahead and sing that. You're just trying to get me. You try no, no. You're just trying to get me. You're trying to get me right now. Because you're always so like reserved and like very. You're very right, because I'm so reserved on three three to go. I feel like you always are. <laughs> you always have your crap together. I should say. Well, I, I, there we have learned to talk. I guess is the right word professionally, if that makes sense. There's certain things you say. There's certain things you don't. There's yep. certain things you address. There's certain things you don't. And, and over the years, the last couple of years especially, we've learned to just shut up and let the camera tell the story. That's, I like it. Yeah. But in my biz, I got to tell the story as I'm painting. So. Okay. So let, how do I say this? Let it dry, let it dry. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> let it dry. Yeah, see? Okay. We got to keep them entertained because I can't interact with anyone. I got gotcha. you. So okay. normally I'm here alone. Okay. And then while I'm here alone, I have to interact and bring the audience into the studio with me so it's, where they can hang out. Mine's dry-ish, but there's like, I, I think I did it a little thick, so there's That's like okay. a couple glops. That's okay. Okay. Yeah, you're good. All right. Now, we are going to grab a little bit smaller brush. I'm going to give you this one right here. Okay, dry that off. I'm going to take this one right here, and you can show your brush. That's what I like to do. I like to just hold it like this, show them what brush I'm using. You're using a little angled brush. If you hold it like this, nobody can see it. So I always put my hand. That's why I always have my hand there, and I show them. What is it? Do they have numbers? Is no, like but number yours two? is just, a, you know just I mean? an How? angled, like a small angled brush. Okay. So we're going to grab red, and I want you to... Oh wait, no, we gotta grab black, that's black. So you can grab a little black and put your line on, okay? Like a baseball seam. Okay, it's super easy. Doesn't have to be straight. All right, thicken that up a little bit. Thicken that up. Add a little bit more paint on there. 
Then you went really thick. <laughs> Perfect. Okay. So you see at your bottom, you want to definitely get it all the way to the bottom. If you need to put your canvas up like this, you can. Okay, that's fine. How'd you do that? Did you hang it? Yeah. There's like a little lip on the back right of here? the canvas. Yeah, and then you just... Yeah, I don't trust that. <laughs> that's all right. <laughs> then you can rinse off your brush. It doesn't have to be perfectly rinsed off, and then we can grab... I like to add a little bit of black with the red, just a tiny little dot to make the red a little bit darker. And then on each side, you're just going to make those seams. Okay. Now they don't have to be perfectly straight, but you do want them lined up. With each other? With each other. Okay. Okay. Super easy. Maybe do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Maybe do like twelve or thirteen. Looking good. It's looking pretty fancy. Now you're gonna have a nice baseball painting to hang in your house. Do you have a baseball themed house? No. But you play baseball. Softball? Baseball? Softball. Softball. For Grace Church. Grace Church. That's where we met? At, at church. At church. We played last night. We won 10 to 1. We play here in Wadsworth. At Memorial Park. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yep, I know where that's at. I used to play softball there, too. It wasn't through Grace Church, though. Do you see what I did here? I'm like, let me go no. ahead and do one side first. Oh, I see it. I see it. Now I can now I can go faster and just line them up. All right. Ooh, look how I pulled that green in. <laughs> it's all right. You can fix it later after it dries a little bit. Then we can go back over it. This is pretty fun, huh? Everyone gets real quiet at this time. It's like the detail time. I'm focused. Yep. Everyone gets real quiet. They focus. And they're quiet. It is really easy to get lost in a painting while you're painting. That's why people do it. Mm-hmm. Yeah, there's some that... Um, sometimes it's hard for me to, to sit and do paintings like with the kids around or my husband or people in the studio. Um, sometimes I just like to pull an all-nighter and sit in the studio and paint, which doesn't happen very much anymore. Why don't you throw one at the bottom down there? It doesn't happen very often because I've got to be up the next day and be a mom, right? There was a lot that happened during the pandemic that allowed people to relax amidst all the stress. And it was, you know, stuff like this, when you would just say, hey, I'm going to paint a painting. We know. did a lot of lives okay. um, on our Facebook pages for people. We also did paint kits. We did virtual parties. So the f one of the fun virtual parties was somebody had hired us up here through our Wadsworth store, the North. <laughs> And um, I was teaching the Zoom class, so I was down south. And a lady got on, and I was like, oh, hi, how are you? And I'm always interacting with my people, so I'm talking to her. And she was like, um, oh, yeah, I'm down here in Clearwater. And I'm like, are you kidding me? I'm in Tarpon Springs. And I'm like, we shipped your stuff <laughs> from Wadsworth when you could have just came and picked it up. Yeah. So it was neat because she was super close. Okay, take a little bit of black. And I want you to make a hole, like where you, where the, where it would be coming out of, the stitch. Oh. You can do it. It's just a quick dab. And then your painting's done, so it's super easy. Um, so that was kind of fun. 
And I also ran into a lot of people who um, know about Medina or Wadsworth or Akron. And a lot of Ohio people live down there. Well, I mean, you get, you know, uh, what are they called? Snowbirds? Yeah. So it's, it's basically, you know, all the, a lot of the older folks decide to winter in Florida. Okay. And then because of the difference in, in uh, restrictions and regulations during, yeah. the, during the pandemic, mm -hmm. a lot of people preferred to be in Florida to Ohio. So, yeah, I could see you. I mean, we call, we call the Outer Banks Akron South, you know, when they, yeah. as, soon as, as, soon as, as soon as summer hits and school empties out, I mean, you go down to the Outer Banks and right. you see Ohio State stuff everywhere you go. Um, so, yeah, Florida, obviously the same. Yeah. All right. How are you doing? Good. Look, at you're done. Dab, I dabbled. Look, Di I have this for you. Dibbled and dabbled. Do you love your painting? Uh, I don't love it, but I, I feel it's, um, what's the right word? It is okay. All right. All right. We'll make, we'll make you love it, but first I want you to own it. Okay. So I want you to grab a little bit of black, roll that little tiny brush in it, and then take a little bit off to the side because you've got a lot of paint on there again. <laughs> And I want you to own your painting. Okay. So whatever your initials are, okay. whatever you want to put, um, I want you to go ahead and at the bottom, I like to put CM and circle it. Okay. Um, wherever you want to want to own your painting, you go right ahead and do that. Got it. All right. And then we're going to tell everyone thanks for painting with us today. Okay. And tell everyone Which what camera? amazing artists they are. <laughs> and we hope to paint with you guys soon. If I can do it. You can do it. <laughs> Perfect. You are watching WCTV, Wadsworth Community Television.